What is up everybody, this is Moritz here from Sectionster once again and today we are going to be having a look at this testimonial slider section right here where you can see it's going to be an infinity loop and you can even implement videos inside the section so that's a new one for sure and you can decide if it's going to be a video, a photo or whatever you prefer and here you have some nice little markers as well of the, po the person who commented it and what we're going to do is fill this whole section with content and also add some nice little customizations to it. So let's get right into it. The first thing I did for it is that I headed on over to the Shopify App Store where I did get the Section Store app. It's a component library with over 200 fully customizable Shopify exclusive components and the section I used for this tutorial is the Testimonial 12. We should be able to find it right here. Let's type it in. That's the Testimonial 12. Let's just simply click on it. This is how it can look like. This is also another version of it. So as you can see, we can pretty much customize everything, fill it with videos, fill it with photos, and also change the background color, the text, whatever you prefer. And you can simply get this for a one-time charge of $9. It means if you bought it once, you'll own it forever. And also you can customize it to your likings. And you're not gonna need an expensive developer to code that for you. So at the end of the day, it's a big, money saver and you still have all the options in the world to do whatever you want to do with it so yeah after successfully getting the section head back to the my sections area of the app where you can find a collection of all the sections you are owning and this is the one we just saw simply add it to the theme you're using in my case it's the dawn live theme and then open up the theme editor you just installed it to right here but it does work on every theme so don't worry about that and this is the one we saw in the beginning of the video. If we would want to start completely from scratch, just scroll down at the section here. It's called SS Testimonial 12, so you can easily find it like that. And the first thing I would like to do is actually fill those two blocks with content as well. I want to chuck in an image right here. Just pick a random one of those. And here you can see that block consists out of the image. And also here we can decide what type it is in this case i want it to be an image and here we can change the text as well so it's going to update live change this as well or oh, rocks so this is changeable too and we could also select the video and that is what i'm going to show you now so if we click on this one put video on and click here on select video from our shopify ones we have already installed Let's just simply put one of those here and we're going to do that because the color looks nice and directly we can see the video. Let's save it all up. And the last thing I would like to do is also do some customizations to the whole thing itself. Maybe change the star color, the text size, the background, whatever you name it. So let's click on testimonial. Here we can see the headline. Don't miss out. We'll just do that right here. Here you can see it got changed. We can change the font as well. So that is something you can do of course the whole thing is fully responsive we made sure of that as well you can see those little bubbles right here and in a second i'm also going to show you how you could add the arrows as well for mobile here we have a bunch of other things like how many slides you want to see per view so here we could do 5.1 so everything is going to be a bit wider the gap is a bit big so i want to have that a bit tighter as well if we save it up all the changes are going to get applied and if i would use autoplay we would see the videos getting deployed straight away if i scroll down a bit we can see a bunch of other customization options star icon star size and yeah that is pretty much that and if we go all the way down to the bottom we can also see we could pick something for the arrows as well and we want to show them on mobile as well that is what i was saying so now they're going to pop up on mobile as well and here we have all the customizations like for example the stars color i do want to have them in orange that is something we could change i also want to have a different background color so i'm scrolling all the way down here set the background color so it's going to connect well with the one above and now i also want to have the headline in white so the contrast is going to be better and this is looking way better already and as you can see it's connecting super well with that section so i'm going to save it all up and we have a final look at it in the live version and i hope you guys found that useful so far and got some ideas how you can customize it to your likings At the end of the day it's your creativity which pretty much brings borders to this but yeah i hope you come up with really nice ideas 
forgot to change the arrow color right here but we could easily do that as well with arrow color right here so I'll just do that as well and with that successfully being done we can pretty much round it up I give this a final little reload and I hope you guys found it useful and with that being said have a good one and peace out